In today's video, we're gonna talk about one of the most popular cat breeds, the Maine Coon, specifically the female Maine Coon, and why this cat may not be best for you. Maine Coons are big cats, they're loving, they're adorable, but a female Maine Coon comes with its own set of challenges. In this video, we'll share seven reasons why this cat may not be best for you. The first reason a female Maine Coon may not be best for you is because of their scratching habit. Like most cats, Maine Coons have a natural urge to scratch. Female Maine Coons will get their claws into anything. This means that you'll need to invest in a good scratching post and train your female Maine Coon to use it. Otherwise, your furniture might be in trouble. This can be frustrating as a pet owner, but just know that Maine Coons and other cats really like to do this because it helps dull their claws and it helps trim their claws. This is what they've evolved doing. Now you can help out by trimming their claws and giving them a scratching post. The second con of a female Maine Coon is that they can be very picky about their sleeping arrangements. They like to have a comfortable place to sleep, but they also need plenty of space to stretch out. Male Maine Coons are a little bit more flexible, a little bit more go with the flow, but females, they're called prima donnas. They like things a certain way and on their terms. So this means you'll need to invest in a large and comfortable cat bed, otherwise your female Maine Coon might take over your own bed. The number three con of a female Maine Coon is that they produce a lot of waste, which means you'll need to clean their litter box frequently. Female Maine Coons are big cats, and so that means a lot of poop, a lot of urine. This can be a big hassle, especially if you have a busy schedule or multiple cats. So we recommend getting multiple litter boxes and make sure you stay on top of this. It's not a big deal if you stay on top of it, but it can really add up quickly if you don't. So make sure you have multiple litter boxes and on top of cleaning them. The fourth con about female Maine Coons is they can be quite demanding when it comes to their food. Again, female Maine Coons are a little bit more it's my way or the highway versus the male Maine Coon that's more go with the flow. Females have a big appetite and they need to be a well-balanced diet to stay healthy. This means you'll need to invest in high quality cat food and make sure your Maine Coon is getting the right amount of nutrients. We recommend We Feed Raw. It's raw food portioned out perfectly for your Maine Coon. There's a link in the description for 25% off your first order. The fifth con of female Maine Coons is that they have a lot of fur, which means they'll need a lot of grooming. Females have a thick, luxurious coat that can be easily tangled or matted if not properly cared for. Maine Coons are large cats. This means you'll need to invest in a good grooming brush and spend time brushing your female Maine Coon regularly. If you do this, shedding and grooming won't be too big of a deal. But again, if you let this go and you get behind on it, then you can have a big problem on your hands. The sixth con about female Maine Coons is that they can be quite active and playful. This usually is a good thing, but in this case, it means that they need plenty of toys and stimulation. Female Maine Coons also need you to be around to play and explore with them. So you need to provide them with plenty of toys and you need to keep them entertained as much as possible with lasers, fake mice, anything you can to help play and stimulate both their mind and body will be great for a female Maine Coon. If you have a busy schedule or don't want to do this, then a female Maine Coon may not be best for you. Finally, the seventh con of female Maine Coons is that they can be prone to certain health problems, such as hip dysplasia and heart disease. This means you'll need to make sure you're taking your female Maine Coon to the vet regularly and stay on top of any potential health issues. If you detect health issues early, then usually they're not a problem. But if you never go to the vet and then something pops up, it's usually too late and can be difficult to change or to deal with. So there you have it, the seven cons of owning a female Maine Coon. Despite these challenges, they're wonderful cats and can make great companions. As long as you're willing to put in the time and effort to care for them properly, a female Maine Coon can be the perfect addition to your family. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.